guys. Welcome to Hi. another episode. The Pusher and the Crab. Yeah, today first we're going to do unboxing. first unboxing video here. Yeah, kind of excited, man, to see small micro amps. The new technology that arrived from the market maybe five to ten years ago. <laughs> but we're having a go at it now. Exactly. So we went ahead and we got some of these nice amps. This one is a base amp. It's the YoYo Micro MA10 amp for bass. And this one is the Blackstar Fly 3, I think. 3 mini, I think. Yeah. Ah, 3 mini, yeah. Exactly. This one is maybe more famous than this one, but we're gonna ha go ahead and try the both of them. So, you wanna start? Yeah. Sure, man. Yeah. Let's uh, start with the big guy. Yeah, man. You go ahead. Let's see. I'm gonna open this carefully in case we have to send it back. Never know. Exactly. So it says this is supposed to be a base amp, micro base amp. You can power it with six AA batteries. Ah, nice. It comes with the. It comes electricity. with the electricity. That's well, cool. Oh, wow. Oh, look at this thing. I imagined it to be smaller, I have to say, but I hoped it to be smaller. <laughs> but how is the weight? Light and easy. Oh, oh wow. Yeah, maybe the batteries are the heaviest thing in this thing. And that's 10 watt I'm seeing here. That is not bad. 10 watt is already a lot for a base. Uh, it's a lot. Because I think we, the least you should get probably we tried out also this guy exactly we're base. trying this uh, the black star base amp and i have to say we were kind of not so impressed with it no. obviously with this small kind of things you're you're always restricted somewhere though, so yeah cool ah, so this color is nice. beige cover has a volume knob Turns nicely, chrome yeah. knob, gain knob, drive channel, input for your bass. Should I do a close up from the camera? Input Maybe. for the headphones and the aux in for having your MP3 player play or whatever. Let's go ahead and see this from closer. Okay, guys, that's about it. Here are the knobs, they look nice. What is it made of? Plastic or? Plastic for sure. Yeah. yeah. Extreme plastic. Extreme. Which is fine for 35 bucks. Yeah, but the price is obviously amazing of this thing. And it comes with AC. That is a hammer thing, man. I'm gonna slowly walk you back, guys. Do we even have a Prezer here? Oh, that is a good question, man. Or we do it directly with batteries, because that's yeah, what most people what anyway yeah, going to will do for. want to do. So let me go ahead and open mine in the meantime, so you can <laughs> put this battery in. So this is, like I said, the Blackstar Mini 3, and I'm gonna open it soon with a knife. It's uh, by far smaller than this Yoyo one. So that is kind of on the good side if you want to put it in your backpack or I don't know, wherever. And I bought a, a very uh, nice edition of it. And I will tell you which one it is. Because I think it's a... What is this? Any one of you guys know maybe? Let me know in the... Let us know in the comment section below what's the oh, version here. Nice. You know, it, it looks cool. <laughs> it just BPMF. Looks yeah, probably some kind of band tribute. Yeah. Don't blame us for not knowing it. But maybe it's a, a nice band to go ahead and check it out. It comes with this Silicia thing that you can throw, apparently. 
And what else is there? There's some sticker. Nice. Sticker is always good to have. We like it. Uh, Black Star VIP access. Gives you all exclusive content, access, register your product, and more. Check it out. That's not bad. So, what else is here? Yeah, that's just the manual, and we're gonna read through it another day. And yeah, that's basically all you got here. So no AC on this one, that's a bit, uh, disappointing. A bit disappointing, but yeah. And I we went ahead before. and the uh, AC to buy is uh, kind of um, expensive. I found it for 33 bucks, I think, on Toman. But I think this one comes Ah, with a nice new Ooh, set, set of batteries. batteries. Are you kidding me? Much appreciated. Ooh, Much yeah. appreciated here. This I didn't think of. Yeah. That's a surprise. That's a real Ooh. nice surprise here. So we don't even need the other batteries. Yeah, I think in the end we're almost good to go. I with, uh, would say so, yeah. Two amp setup. This one comes out of the box ready to play. Yeah. This one comes with the AC, so you can I'll plug it in. I'll go ahead and close up here. For the people to see the amp so this is what it's looking like on the top you have a gain volume eq delay power button and what is this delay lever and blues powers yeah input mp3 line in and em out for and phones that's the black star here guys batteries Cool. Yeah, let's go ahead and try it. Yeah, in the meanwhile, I'm gonna plug in my bass guitar. So our main idea why we even got these amps is for playing gigs outside on the street, maybe even in the woods. Let's see if the volume is loud enough to do so. Probably not, but still, some, maybe some nice amps to play at home at least. And the most important thing for us was to check that the guitar and the bass can harmonize together and play well together. Oh, this, this sounds thing is working. really nice, man. Like a real amp. Yeah. I'm gonna go through the volume, tone I have on 50%, gain I put on 50%, I didn't put the drive channel. No, this is full volume. This is one fourth. The amp, three quarters. Yeah. Oh, that sounds quite good already. Oh, this is full. Lovely. Yeah, nice, nice, nice. I will keep it on this setting. Let's see what the gain knob does. Oh, no, it changes a lot of the volume, obviously. Ah, yeah, from three quarters with my bass, it starts to go into overdrive. And then yeah, extremely yes. goes into overdrive even without the drive channel on. Ah, this is turning on the drive channel. Yeah, we still, I don't like this. I'm not gonna use it. <laughs> yeah, that ends up to the user. Going to half a little bit further away than half gives you still a clean sound for your bass. Yeah, yeah, nice man. So I love it, man. So I'm also uh, on all 50% except for the gain level, um, which I have on one fourth. So let's see what we got here. So still we're uh, I have to maximize my guitar. Obviously. So we can hardly hear it. Let's put up the gain to 50% as well. Ah, that's a cable issue we got here again. Let's do four, uh, one fourth. We can almost not hear it. Let's go up. It's starting to hear something on 50%. I 
think it's pretty decent, man, for an amp in this size. And yeah, yeah. Let's play a song. Let's play a Let's song. See how these two amps harmonize together. That Bottle is what the guys are here. For. I would ask for please. Yeah, that's a song we recently made. So don't. Uh, yeah, hang out for this. <laughs> some more content if you guys would like us to maybe as a conclusion guys if you want to set up a two people band playing outside battery powered this is a way to get started i think this guy cost around 70 bucks ah, yeah. 80 maybe this was 35, 35 bucks yeah. only and yeah you have the setup to go for 100 bucks man that's awesome guys really you might not complete with a full drum set but a cup on yeah or, or even uh, maybe we are planning also to use it with a sequencer on the side, but this we're gonna check out in another in one of our next videos. Thank you guys. Keep on rocking. Ciao. Bye. I hope I pressed record. Yeah.